I know I'm late for the special. Allow me to explain. So, this video is, uh, well, an explanation video for, well, a bit of the reasons why I was, well, missing, or, well, absent, during my time for the, well, for a while. In this video, I'm, I split into, well, four different uh, categories of what I'm going to be covering. Starting off with why I am late for the celebration. For those that don't know, this is Five Nights at Freddy's 10th, and count it, 10th anniversary. Technically a very big celebration, I mean there's been a lot of uh, sneak peeks for the FNAF movie, script wise and other category wise, and also content that was also made as well from the hottest dog, and well, uh, others I can't really remember on the top of my head right now. So, why am I late? Well, the video that I had planned for, t well, for yesterday, it's unfortunately still in production. Mostly due to, well, IRL delays. Because, one, I hilariously misjudged how much time I was going to have. For starters. The second, the, well, one of my devices is, uh, well, needing upgrade, well, is needing to be replaced. However, the replacements we got weren't of best quality. Yeah, we, we need to return these soon before the the whole 30 days return thing expires. But other than that, I've also just been a, been trying to help out with my family. That and there's been a bit of a, well, drama on my end which I am not going to bring up in this video. Trust me, the drama has actually gone so hard that it's going to get its own video, but that will be released on a later date when I will, one, actually write a script for it, basically stating how much I am actually ticked off, but also want to get the okay from some of our people to, well, to use in this video, well, to use in that video. Other than that, that video will be safer in our story. And, well, probably if you can tell from the title of this video, I actually am playing on, well, this is actually going to be a, a two-parter. This part one is me just explaining why I'm late for the, why I'm late in a, in all of my, well, I guess in this case, FNAF-related content. But also, well, for the second, it's basically going to be what I was well, working on. Which I might as well uh, show up a few sneak peeks, if I won't remember when I do it in editing. But I have actually been deciding to draw every FNAF character by hand from FNAF 1 to Security Breach. Yeah. I did the, uh, the big oops and, uh, skipping day one, and then trying to, well, hurrying it all of it done. <laughs> because, well, I end up realizing that, well, uh, <laughs> I have not drawn the Five Nights at Freddy's characters in a, in a while. Probably not ever since the, well, uh, well, the, the n last year's anniversary. And that was only a few characters. Not really colored, and... And yes, the video was a little, uh, choppy. With, well, of course, some of, well, artwork being, well, uh, made by some, well, friends, which I'm <laughs> very grateful for. 
but to uh, continue explaining with probably the, the next topic. Plans for the next anniversary. I will admit that that's if I will uh, remember and don't wait last minute to actually start production. <laughs> Again. I am actually planning on pulling a, I guess in this case, a hottest dog in a way. Basically with all the FNAF characters coming together for a big celebration. I, I'm i planning for, well, the 11th to, well, uh, actually show more interaction with the, well, with the franchise of a hold. And probably the very big difference is it's going to be animated. Well, uh, okay, big, okay, uh, quote, those, uh, dash quote things for the, well, uh, animated part. Because I will tell you this, animation, it's not easy. And I don't even need to, well, explain it. There, there's already, like, a billion other videos basically explaining how hard, why animation is so important. But also, that's not an easy task. <laughs> but now to go to more of the, well, FNAF-related content on my, uh, well, on my YouTube channel, which I will admit, probably by the time this video gets out, there's probably going to be a few uh, changes. Are they my greatest idea? No. Do I have a full reason why I'm probably going to be doing this? Yes. Will I explain this reason in this video? No. But I think to really get started off, let's go to the series that, well, uh, that a lot of you, well, might know. And that series' name is Meme Chaos. And the question, and well, for this part is, uh, will there be a Meme Chaos 5? Honestly, looking of where, uh, well, looking of where the, the series is standing right now, along with, uh, well, the series of a hold, I think it's safe to say that there will not be a Meme Chaos 5. Or at least, not in the near future. I will probably, uh, well, go into more detail on... Well, actually, I might as well go into full detail why. But some of these will, of course, be picked up again in an RP, yo, but... A bit of the reason why I'm, well, wanting to, uh, well, can meme chaos... Well, to put it simply, it was a bit of a, it was a mess. A, a, a chaotic series, you could say. I mean, yes, I did, well, probably for a few episodes, there were at least something planned, but other than that, there wasn't really much. It was just a bunch of random jokes. I mean, there was a plot that was originally planned for it, but... Eh, that plot has kind of... ...ceased to exist now. Probably because of how complicated it is. I mean... Yeah, the series was, well, fun and great, but... Now, looking back on it, it did have a lot of the uh, downs. And there was a lot of drama and toxicity that was happening. And right from under my own nose. I mean, yeah, there were definitely a lot of uh, good moments recording it, but... There was a lot of the uh, background chaos that was happening that uh, just 
I think just sucked all of the potential out of the whole series entirely. So I think it's safe to say Meme Chaos is a is a dead series. I mean, it had its road, but then it dried out. I mean, if there will be a Meme Chaos 5, I I honestly don't know. There might be, there might not. Who knows? I mean, I definitely don't have future versions, so I'm not sure if it'll uh, get brought up or not. And now I guess to, well, the, uh, I guess in this case, the, the final part of this video. Will there be a FNAF series? And if so, when will it come out? I will admit, I actually was uh, throwing around this idea for many reasons. For starters, I definitely do want to make a, well, a Five Nights at Freddy's related series. I mean, this is one of the franchises that really introduced me to the internet. Well, other than the, well, uh, the plush tubers and Gary's mod, Five Nights at Freddy's was a, one of those core elements. I mean, if it probably wasn't for Freddy's, I probably wouldn't even know what Gary's mod was. Heck, maybe not even, I wouldn't even know what a SMG4 was either, because that was one of the videos that ended up getting uh, recommended to me. Well, specifically the second game. Well, the, the second installment. This series has been a part of me for... for years. And I, too, have wanted to make a, well, a series of my own. I will admit, I am throwing around a lot of ideas to... see if I, will can make a series or not. FNAF-related. If I can, there will definitely be a trailer for it. I mean, yeah, there definitely will be some uh, elements that will somewhat be around the, the canon, but by the very same time, probably not. Not sure, it's a... You can never really know with these things. And I think with that said... I think it's safe to say we're going to end this video off here. Part 2 will come out when it's uh, when it's done because by the time I'm actually recording this, I'm only halfway done with Five Nights at Freddy's Pizza Simulator. I still need to draw Help Wanted and Security Breach. But uh, other than that, I guess, uh, thank you for coming to this little, uh, TED Talk video, or whatever this video is, but... Happy 10 years, Finance of Fridays. And thank you for the fun. Catch you on the flip side.